What's going on my people? So today we've got a very exciting one for you guys. Something to do with the Frenchy side of things and the bloodlines that me and my pal Central Kingdom that you've already seen with us uh, that we've got planned basically. Something that he doesn't even have a clue about basically at the minute. What? I'm going to go seal the deal without him even knowing. Then we're going to call him up and see what his reaction is. Whether it's going to be a yeah or a no but... I know how he is, I know how he's moving. We're here to just nothing but elevate our programs, keep thriving forward and, and, and gonna be producing the new shows for you guys. So uh, this one's gonna be massive. We're gonna wait for you guys, to, uh, we're gonna wait to reveal it later on in the video for you lot to see what we're really going to uh, go collect. But yeah, let me just tell you man, we've just had to break the bank for this one. Um, wait for this one to come out, it's gonna be serious. Yeah, in this vlog that I'm about to show you guys, it's going to be all to do with the Frenchie side of things of the bully lair. And basically, we're going to show you who I get all my Frenchies off, basically. Uh, with the bully side of things, people ask me if I had a mentor and stuff. Um, I didn't. I had to go out and learn the hard way and, and learn it all myself. I was fortunate enough to have a good friend that's already in the Frenchie industry, very well established. One of the first people in the UK to ever use Brutus himself. And uh, yeah, we're about to introduce him to you guys now and show you one of the gurus of the UK on this Frenchie game. My man's really leveled up in this and um, yeah man, very inspirational. I'm gonna show you a little insight of one of the real Frenchie bosses. Let's go. As you can see, yeah, we're going to show you how he balls his setup. He's a licensed breeder as well with the Frenchies. Very, like I said, very well established, and this is where I got all my Frenchies from. I actually co owned my boy Doughboy with him. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to show you a little bit of what the bloodline and what he's got here. So, what we got here, Jen? So, this, is, this one's Winnie, double bred Brutus. Um, she's a lilac and tan carrying cream and fluffy. Then, next one along is a uh, Poppy, or Peanut. That's Peanut, Poppy, yeah, that's Peanut. Peanuts are new shade chocolate, carries blue, carries fluffy. Then next to her is Licorice Lucy. She's a black and tan carrying cream, cocoa, fluffy, blue and pink. Wow. Yeah, mega dog that one. You said you've got the, all the DNAs in that one. Yeah, come on, mate, I'll chase it. How old is she now? Eight months. So you get one yeah, of the, the one oldest of the one in the world with that DNA. There ain't nothing else like it. Oldest one in the and world. Even there if there go. was, there ain't gonna be nothing built like her. Look at her. See the structure on her there? Unreal. Come on. Then, that is Poppy, absolute unit, Brutus daughter. Is that Brutus daughter, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. One of the originals. Yeah, mate, she is. Rest in peace, rest in peace. Yeah. And so he, was he one of, the, one of the first people in, in yeah, the UK so to use Brutus? When June opened him, I think I'd give him like 10 quid or something and went and banged straight onto my bitches. My luck, both of them missed, didn't they? But I went straight back six months later and put it across both of them again and then had a couple of litters out of it. There you go, you heard it from so Don Frenchie, for the people that don't know, that's Junior. You've seen him on my Power Central Kingdom's uh, YouTube channel as well. Yeah, and I've um, got a lot of time for Junior, he's a good guy. Very good friend yeah, of uh, uh, Jamie's as it is as well. So yeah, no, it's like Central's learnt from the Junior side and I've learnt from Tyree Ball's Jamie. So yeah, we just wanted to show you basically what, we, what we've got in stock and obviously we've got something special that we're obviously collected from Tarry Bulls Yeah, uh, the little today. pink carrier. Where is she? There we go. Special, special. There we go. It's the, built, the, the beans has been spilt now. We've got a pink carrier coming. <laughs> She's about somewhere. Right now, we're trying to find her. She's doing a runner. There she is. We found her. Special, very, 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 very excited about this one. So, can you tell us a little bit about this one here, James? So, she's a baby pink daughter. Blue and tan, covered in cream, carries cocoa, carries pink, four panel health clear. I'm going to say it, and I don't care what anyone can... I'll stand this dog next to any pink carrier on the planet. I've already had two litters of them as well. She's the best structured pink carrier on the planet right now. I know she is. Look at the face. Yeah, she's very clean, that. that snub nose. And is that what, is that what you're looking at? I want structure. As much as I chase DNA, structure's just as important to me. Yeah. And there ain't nothing cut touching this. You're saying compact one? Unreal, mate. Nice Unbelievable, easy. this dog. What, what's, your, what's this on your generations now then, Jay? So, her mum is Winnie, which I produced Winnie's mum. Mm. So, I used the stud on Winnie's mum, produced Winnie, mm. and then produced this one. So, she's my third generation. So as you can but see, obviously I've got five generations, but Winnie was my best. I, I probably own 20 bitches. 
and Winnie's my best structured bitch. Yeah. And then I went down to designer balls, used baby pink, and then this there one you was go. Diego himself. As you can see, um, this is his third gen Frenchie right here, so it's no cap, no cap coloring chasing. My boys no. put structure in from days. Always said it to me. Structure and health, mate. It's, you, it was outsell DNA forever. There we go. But if you can chase both, why not? Yeah. So uh, what, what are you saying then? So these these are the ones to have at the minute in the UK, yeah. But next year. So listen, everyone screams big ropes and does all that, but that takes one one mating and you've got big ropes anyway. Yeah. So one, why not get a dog right, then add that. Yeah, you said that to me before. 50% yeah. of it goes, uh, if you've got a visual for rope. Big, visual big rope, half your little big rope straight away. So get the structure. Yeah, that's why there's already big DNA ones of big rope popping up, left, right and centre. They're already out there now. Okay. But you you only seen, I've probably maybe seen five visual pinks yeah. in the world. Oh. Total, do you know what I mean? There we go. Because everyone's got to put the pink in, then wait a year to get a visual. Okay. You can't just do that with a big rope, it's quick. Like you said, it's, it's, it's not, a, not a rush process, you have to make sure you no, get it right. to get structure. You, mate, there's people throwing um, Pekingese over Frenchies to get pinks. Yeah. Because it's an easy way of getting pink, but what are you going to make? It's yeah. going to be a little more pink. Yeah. Is very, very clean, Baby it? pink's third or fourth generation now, Frenchie. Yeah. Obviously pink gets put in from somewhere. Yeah. Everyone knows that, so does all DNA, do you know what I mean? But 100%. Why are you going to use what they used five years ago when you can pay a little bit of money and be four generations ahead invest into your program and, right and if you elevate. if you respect what you're doing you should do that yeah yeah and diego's doing it right he's actually made the like he said he's his third generation baby definitely got the quality there yeah now she's the best mate the best there is we've she's already yours. got we've already got one that we haven't revealed um yet from towie balls as well and we haven't put him on there yet look at her mate. she's Little so special brain. we haven't thought of her name yet bless her she is special but yeah, this is me and Central Kingdom's pink carrier Fema. Yeah, I'm real. Joining the program straight from Towie Balls. I appreciate it all of it, my brother, and showing us the uh, showing us the way and I'm here, always know that. putting us through the guidance of it all. But yeah, for structure, for me, you know, as a, as a bully breeder myself, uh, structure is very important. I always speak about structure uh, and clean. And for you guys that already know, I put Doughboy in the ring. Um, he always comes out with a ribbon as well because of the structure of him. So mm -hmm. for you guys that want to know as well, Doughboy was created by Jamie as well. Uh, one of the first ever Mr. Magic Sons in the UK before he got in, what is it, exported back he over went to, back out to America. He yeah. went back over there. So obviously structure, like I said, from, from, that, from, from, from the jump. But there she is. There we have it, guys. Now we've got to go break the news to Old Central. See what he thinks of her. Yeah, she's <laughs> asleep when you were there. Look at her. She's so special. Now, I really appreciate the opportunity as well, sir, to be able to own one of these quality females like this. Wouldn't have been able to do it without you, my brother, so I appreciate you. Look at her. Look yeah, at her. Poser, innit? Sick, yeah, you're going to get some nice pictures of her. Look at her. Look. <laughs> so this is, uh, this is one of the, the key, one of the cheat codes to the program right now. Yeah. Structures there. Health, full panel clear. We've got all your paperwork in there with Chris. I paid two and a half grand on the litter just to do colour and health. So there you see it guys, even even with the health testing, uh, my man's putting investing straight back into his programme to make sure he knows everything about his Frenchies before they go out to the to, to the new owners and stuff. And obviously to learn about them, like he said before, structure and health first over always, DNA. Always. If you can add DNA with that, you'll win. Doesn't yeah. matter. I think you've done it here anyway. Yeah mate. You've done it here, mate. Yeah, special dog that is. Yeah, no, appreciate that, my brother. Well, appreciate you. So, what's going on, people? We just got back from obviously being from Tawi Balls um, and had a little look into what we've got coming. Uh, we're going to literally call now uh, Central Kingdom, who is my business partner with the Frenchie office. I'm going to give him a call now and hit him up with this mad surprise. He do not even have a clue what's going on right now. Let's see how he feels about this one. What's going on, my people? So yes, I've had a phone call from Mr. Bully Lair. He said he's got a surprise for me. So I'm going to have to call him up. He said to give him a FaceTime. So I'm going to call him up, give him a FaceTime, see what surprise he has in, um, see what surprise he has in store for me. And yeah, we'll go from there. So yeah, let's FaceTime Bully Lair and see what surprise he has, yeah? How's he tell the band surprise and FaceTime? And he's not even answering, blood. Is this guy alright? Yo! What's going on, my brother? Well, go on, I just literally I just sorted out the the banana chocolate mail, the one I got from Urban Constrictors. 
You get me? What's that, a male or female? This is the male. This is one of our stud males in the, in the camp. Alright then. You know what I'm saying? So oh, go on, go on anyway. Let's talk about this surprise, bro. Go on, go on. Yeah, what's no, happening? Sorry, I know you got your hands full there, bro. Um, basically, uh, you know where we got our pink carrier from? Uh, the baby pink son. Yeah, what? Well, Tawi Bulls? Yeah. Yeah? Uh, basically, I just went round there and... Uh, yeah, Did you pick right. up the, the health thing? Yeah, and uh, something else as well, G. What's, what else, bro? <laughs> I can't lie, I just dropped the bag on it, bro. I just on what? The on the female, bro. Pink carrier, wrapped in cream. Yeah, cocoa. Baby pink daughter. Bow! <laughs> so he's saying you just caught the ting now? Yeah, I can't lie, bro. You just have to just come believe in the process, bro. You've got your visuals over there with the testable chocolate visuals. Yeah. yeah we've got all the, all, all the new spice. So, so one second, just... let me just make this phone call clear. Have I just rung you up and now I'm in debt? Yeah, basically. <laughs> basically, we just got oh the bag with the baby thing. Bro. Yeah. Bam. You, got, you got your hands full there, boy. So, uh, so we say we got a female now wrapped in cream. We have. So we've not just only got the feet, we only, only just got the studs, shall I say. Yeah. Uh, we've got the baby pink uh, times two Brutus. So what, we've got two baby pink offsprings? Both of them. Third generation, uh, his dad. So these are fourth generation pink carriers. <laughs> Well, I definitely, I'm not buying a house anytime soon now, am I, boy? Nah, you better put that snake back and get on them, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> yeah Alright, cool. Well, so what, have you got her already? Uh, yeah, bro. You if cheeky mug. Back, so he said, I can't back out. You can't back out. That is here, yeah? The Frenchy office, here we come, bro. Say no yeah. more. Listen, I'm going to finish off this snake now, and then yeah. I'm going to give you a buzz back, yeah? No worries, call me back, bro. Yeah, Alright, right, say no you, more, cuz. Love. Take it easy. Cool. Yes, yes, what's going on, my people? So you heard it first there from Bully Lair. I've now just rung him, ended up in debt. So we've not only got one baby pink offspring, we've got two. So big up the Frenchie office, and hopefully we've got this pink program, fluffy program, everything in full swing. Let's go.